All right, today I'm going to show you a reverb called Space Designer. It has some really interesting uh, impulses in there. What I did right now is I just took some kind of pattern from Alter B. I'm using a Latin kit right now. Um, if you guys don't know how to do this, your sequence pattern is right here. You can just click and drop those to the arrange. There's a bunch of built-in patterns you can choose from. Just click on it, drag that to the arrange. There we go. Now, normally, Alter Beat, some of the drums come with space design already in them. So if you open this up, it has a little bit of reverb. As you can see, there is some reverb in here using this impulse. Without it, you might be able to tell the difference. This is a great utility in Logic. Um, if you want to get some kind of like abstract or just a whole different feel to the drums, you can do so. Uh, in the warped effects, they have a bunch of different real bizarre impulses that really alter the drum beat and just create like a real insane out of this world kind of pattern to them. Uh, let's go to ghost rhythms. And since I'm 120 beats per minute right now, Check this out. They have a bunch of already programmed impulses for whatever tempo you're using. So we'll just choose one randomly. Now let's listen to the drums. See how what it was before? The impulse really alters the drum. It's just a great setting if you want to do like some kind of remix. So they're under ghost rhythms, choose 120, or whatever tempo you're using, I'm using 120 right now, and there's just so many to choose from. You can tell it really alters the drum beat. So now that we have that applied, one thing that we can do is if you want to create some kind of remix or changing the drum tones from bridge to bridge or whatever you want to do we can right click this or hit control B for bounce in place we'll just call this drum one and what that does it creates the audio for you which is really great and by default it does mute this so just hit M Let's come back to this Latin kit, open up Space Designer again, and now let's go choose another another pattern. Let's try Zap Rhythm. Okay, what's this sound like? It's a little bizarre. You can adjust everything. Everything is customizable in this. That's what's great about this program. All right, for now we'll just use that. So let's do the same thing. Let's go control B, bounce this in place. We'll call this drum two. And now we have both drums with the different effects on them. Same drum pattern, it just alters the sound, it renders the sound a little bit differently. Uh, we'll add a lot of flavor to your song. I just wanted to do a quick tutorial and show you how to do this and all the capabilities sound design has, or space design, sorry. Uh, it's a great tool, definitely get familiar with this. It can uh, really enhance uh, your drum beats or anything really. There you have it, there's a quick tutorial on space designer. Stay tuned for some more videos. Thanks for watching.